Hey guys, welcome to Abundant Life with Five. I'm Priscilla. If you're new, please subscribe, like, comment, and share. Today we are in our Walmart, and let's see what the shelves are looking like. Today is October 8th, and let's see. Okay guys, we are in the meat area, and it's average. It's usually less full than this, so it looks, it looks pretty good. The steak looks pretty okay. And you guys said you guys want to see the meat by the pound. This is $8.97. This is the ribeye steak. And they also have the cube steak for $5.96 a pound. And what else do they have? The thin steak, round thin steak, $7.74 a pound. So let's see what the rest of the meat is looking like. It's pretty full today. Today is October 8th and it's pretty full. You can also can your meat. If you don't have farm animals and stuff like that, you can also can your meat. There's a lot of YouTube videos about canning your meat. So you can can your beef, you can can your chicken, you can a lot of stuff. This right here is the only section that I see that's pretty empty right here. But for the most part, the chopped meat is good, the chicken is good, everything is pretty good. Hey okay guys, I'm gonna pick up this chicken. It's 4 15 and I don't know how much it is a pound. Let's see. I think it's 97 cents a pound. So I'm gonna get that one because we're gonna get this steak right here. It's 5.88 and it's 7.74 a pound. Okay, I'm gonna get this ground beef. It is 2.96. And guys, they also have more meat over here. It's the first time ever that I've seen all of this meat right here. Okay. They are, now I can say they are totally stocked and they also have their turkeys. So I advise you guys to get your turkey like now. Let's see what the price is looking like. It's $148 a pound and they are going at, going for like $19, $20, $24. These turkeys are expensive. It'd probably be cheaper just to grow it. So guys, I cannot wait till we start growing our animals. $27? Are you serious? I'm going to have a boatload of turkeys. Okay, so they're getting ready for their um, holidays, their holidays, because y'all know I don't celebrate um, holidays. I celebrate feast days. So they have this uh, frozen young turkey breast for $1.88 a pound, and they are going for $13, $14. This is something more that I would buy, because, you know, we only have a family of five, and they don't eat a lot of meat, my, my children. $12.78. That's pretty good. And they also have this. People are grabbing these up. These are, let's see... 148 a pound, 31 dollars. Jesus. Okay. Yeah. A lot. Guys, this is the first time that I've ever seen this place full like this. They are totally getting ready for the holidays. As this is the first time that I've seen this freezer kind of packed, which is kind of cool. And it's kind of look like normal, but do not be full. This is still kind of empty, but this is the dessert area, and this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like, guys. So there's still some missing holes. But like I said, the meat area, the guy came out and he's stocking up meat. And then the dairy area, I see people stocking up stuff over there. They must haven't gotten to the french fries yet. But this is what it's looking like so far. And this is also what the freezer is looking like. This, The freezer is still pretty much empty. But they did replace the uh, pieces. A lot of the pieces, it was empty before. So they are, they're getting to it, I guess. They're getting to it. This is still pretty much empty, as usual. But this is, this looks regular. Guys, when I say they are stocking up, they are stocking up, for real, for real. And they do have apple cider vinegar and a whole bunch of vinegar and stuff like that. The vinegar is 2.64. And they have all these nice wines cooking wines as well. You also have the small vinegar for, for 157 So their pickles are pretty much stacked up. So guys, I do suggest that you guys get your favorite condiments because you know, they will be off the shelf soon because these are being pushed up and the big, big, big ones are not really much is left. And I love me some barbecue sauce, so I'm definitely going to be stacking up on that. But I just want you guys to see what it really looks like up close and personal. So some things are being pushed to the front, your jams and stuff. And also learn how to bake. 
totally like YouTube have a whole bunch of videos that you can download about ba you know baking breads, rolls, sliced breads, all types of stuff like that. You guys should really do that. This is what their honey looks like as well. This is what their tuna is looking like right here. And so far it looks pretty good. They're 68 cent a can, which I told you like this. I prefer this from Dollar Tree. And they also have the chicken for 98 cents. The 38, 3.98 one is right here. And then you also have the 7.90, well the 7.48, which that's the one that I'm gonna be also stocking up on. And of course, this is their beef. This is all they have right here. Before they had the chopped meat, today they don't. And it is 7.74. And they also have their corned beef hash, 184. They have the big one for 298. So, and their beans, they also, their beans look pretty good today for the first time in a long time. So guys, I think they're really stocking up for the holidays. <laughs> so um, guys, they, the rice, they have like, maybe like four rice there. That's what it looks like to me. Yeah, they have like maybe five. So this is what it's looking like, guys. They're stocking up. That's what it looks like to me. So that's cool. So as they're putting this stuff out, you guys, you know, you need to start prepping. It's never too late to prep. So things are being, you know, put out once and for all. And this is their canned goods area. And like always, we always see this big hole right here. And this is what it looks like. So this is what it looks like so far. So prep, 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 guys. If you don't get the gist of this, prep, prep, prep. And some people were talking stuff in the, uh, comment section on how I talk. Listen, I'm from New York. This is not my native tongue. I am a Hebrew Israelite. If y'all don't know, I don't know if you guys saw my other videos, but I am a Hebrew Israelite. And, you know, I'm from Brooklyn. And this is how we talk. And this is how I talk. You know, if you don't like how I talk, you know, turn the page. <laughs> but it is what it is, guys. But this is what the macaroni, well, the macaroni and cheese aisle looks like. It's like totally done. But I do recommend that you guys stack up on this. But I had to just, bless you, baby. I had to just throw that in there because I'll be doing some lives soon, guys. So you guys can, you know, we could talk, you know, Q&As and stuff like that. So this is what the yogurt is looking like. And the eggs are like totally packed. That is so cool. Okay. Stock, 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 guys. And their milk. This is what their milk is looking like. Great value, of course. They have the dollar seasonings. You cannot go wrong with that. Guys, if nothing really happens or whatever, you can also still eat this food. So just rotate your food. You know, you better, you're better off being safe than sorry. But get all your favorite foods. These are some of my favorite foods right here. Cornbread. Of course, I eat vegetarian cornbread, which is over here. Because all the rest of it has pork in it, if you guys didn't know. And then this is what the flour looks like. That's terrible. And they do not have any yeast, it looks like to me. Nope, they don't. I think I took the last one the other day. But they do have the package. And that's what it looks like, guys. And then we have the we have the can milk and stuff. Let's see what it looks like from the side. They have maybe three left. You have your can milk, 86 cent. This is the carnation milk. This one's 98 cent. That's a better buy. That's 70 cent. You have your coconut flakes. All your bacon needs right here. They have a big thing of peanut oil for $30. And they do have the oils. This is the first time I'm seeing that the oil is actually full. Guys, I found some, look like pineapple, crushed pineapples for 30 cents. So you know I'm gonna definitely stock up on this. Some crushed pineapples, you can make jams with this and can it, you can do a whole bunch. So I'm gonna stock up on that, guys. That's a good buy. I've told you, I'll be getting lucky with these buys. It's the first time ever, all the tissue. They have all the tissue. There's no push-ups or whatever y'all was calling it. They have all the tissue. First time ever. Let's see back here. There you go. Yeah. So that's cool. They have everything that you need right here. That's cool. And they also have more over here. That's good. This is the first time I've been in here and I've seen this stuff like fully stocked like it's normal. But guys, do not be full. It is not normal. They're just putting out the stuff that they had in the back. They are totally putting out the stuff that they had in the back. So, yeah. They was holding back. So, they holding back. Can you imagine how they gonna do when, you know, stuff hit the fan? Okay, also come to the clearance aisle because they have some cheap stuff. Look at that curtain, $5, $6, $5. Really cheap. This stuff is really nice. They have a stereo install kit. That's cheap, $12, you can't beat that. Or if you're an eBay seller, which guys, I'm about to start getting back on eBay. So please support a Hebrew Israelite family. 
on eBay because I'm about to start stocking up, especially the one in town. Oh, guys, look what I found. Oh, my God, $5. Can you believe that? All praise to Yeshua HaMashiach, as you guys know, as Jesus. Oh, my God, $5, really? And the only one missing? I'm buying that. And look at this iron, guys. I'm telling y'all, I'm about to put the eBay back up. $10. You can make at least, you know, $10 more for that, you know? That's a good brand. What else can we find? Oh my God. All oh, praises. Oh, they have some uh, Castile soap also for $10. That's good. What else do they have? They have a whole bunch of stuff. Baby stuff. Oh yeah. When I get back on my eBay tip, it's on guys. It's on. Definitely. But shalom guys. Bless you. Yeah, loves you. Come out of her. Just store just shop guys just prepare for you and your family shalom bless you y'all loves you come out of her and just 